final notice to Lara Croft, a current tenant of premises. This is to serve as your final notice for the purposes of terminating your ownership of Croft Manor. You are required to immediately vacate and surrender possession of said manor to Atlas de Mornay, executor of estates. Lara, it is unfortunate that you have forced my hand in this matter, but so be it. As you know, your parents appointed me executor of the estate in the event of their absence. Since your mother disappeared, her death was never technically declared. And given the circumstances surrounding your father's death, it's no surprise that he never drafted a formal last will and testament to account for this circumstance. Unfortunately, you have no legal claims to the estate. I'm willing to negotiate a modest monthly stipend from your trust, but only if you leave the manor by week's end. Don't find me on this, Lara. Your mother wouldn't want that. Sincerely, Atlas. There has to be a will or some kind of evidence of what happened to Mum in the manor somewhere. Dad's safe. Hmm, needs a combination. It's got to be in Dad's papers somewhere. Maybe in the library. My birthday crown. <laughs> I was so proud of that thing. <laughs> <laughs> That's my handwriting. My penmanship was pretty good. Dad would have liked me to go to Oxford, but I insisted on UCL. <laughs> yep, looks real. Roth once offered to forge me a fake diploma to show Dad. This is a hell of a thing. I met someone tonight quite unexpectedly. But it shouldn't have been, it's... My parents made a good team, challenging each other from the start. A picture with Dad and Anna. Never liked wearing dresses, but the color was nice. This is probably my grandfather, Benjamin. I finally introduced Richard to the family. It went precisely how I imagined. I see but polite grace. It must have been hard for mum to go against her family's wishes. I'm glad she did. Dad's map of the forgotten cities of northern Syria. He was closer than he knew to finding the Prophet's tomb. Dad's book about immortality myths might be useful in my research. the door to the library. <laughs> this is the map I made for my first expedition with Dad. It shows a path to the library through the circle. Wait, I can get to the library through the old servant's corridor. Dad's artifacts from the Nile Valley. I always love looking at these. Dad became interested in immortality myths after his expeditions to Egypt. Hi, Dad. I've been thinking about Mum lately. I wish I knew more about her. How did you meet? Well, hello there, Sir Lancelot. 
Don't worry, you won't be boring your sword this time. Too dark. Going to need a flashlight. The Grand Hall. Always loved playing in here as a kid. This will be one of the first things to fix. A phoenix figurine. I bet this appealed to Dad's idea of immortality, of rising from the ashes and being born anew. Lara, you know the West Wing is off limits! I'm sorry, I, I just wanted to see... We've been through this. Was Mum's room in here? Just stay out of there, darling. Dad was always so protective of the West Wing. Locked. Need a key to open this. What are you doing sitting there on the floor, Mistress Lara? Immortality artifacts. I think Roth bought this for him from a trader in Greece. Lara, since your return from your expedition to Yamatai, I've grown increasingly alarmed. Looking at the compass, thinking. What about, if I may inquire? Just thinking about discovering faraway places, about finding adventure. The offer came in the post last week, and I still haven't told Richard. <laughs> I'm sure you will, my lady. You've the soul of an explorer, but don't grow up too fast. Hmm, not sure. I really need... Hey Jonah, sorry for not getting back to you sooner. I've decided to do some research at the manor. A lot has happened and I need some time to... Got to remember to pack this for my neck. Should be able to explore the dark now. Amelia, the news has reached Mother. She knows... <sighs> Falling apart. Maybe I should just let my uncle have this place. They say a good test of a relationship is how well you travel together. Well, I'm not surprised he asked her to marry him as soon as he got the idea.
Amelia, I know we have had our differences in recent years. I've tried my... My lord, I hope this missive finds you on a successful expedition and in good health. Poor Winston. I remember being so angry. He was always so patient with me. I'm at a crossroads now. Good lord, that's such a cliché. But there's truth in it. King to Queen One. I'm going to win this time, Winston. <laughs> Clever girl. But you should know by now, winning isn't everything. I would play chess with our old butler, Winston, on this board. Never could beat him. I always chose white. Maybe if I let him go first once in a while, I might have won. Queen to King's Bishop Six. Check. Easy for you to say. You always win. Knight takes queen. What I mean to say is try to enjoy journey, Lara. Don't rush to victory. Bishop to King Seven. Everything is almost ready for Mistress Lara's birthday expedition surprise. It's been a bit of an all hands on deck effort organizing the affair. bottle of wine. Hmm. I can still smell his favorite Bordeaux. Dad, this is it! The basement of despair! Indeed, Lara. Muster your courage, for this is the only path to the Library of Infinite Knowledge. Look there! See the string? An ancient Egyptian tripwire. The Keepers of Knowledge want none to disturb their treasures. We must tread carefully. Let me lead. I know how to spot all the traps. I'm sure you do, my darling. Lead on! My stuffed bear. I couldn't have a tomb without a mummy. One of the wire traps Winston made for my birthday expedition. <laughs> Winston used my hair ribbons to make this. He and Dad put a lot of work into this. damage from the main hall above.
adding electricity to the manor. Dad used to say his granny hated all the bright lights. Hmm, there's a missing page. Amelia left tonight. She packed her suitcase and walked right out of here and I didn't even notice. Like those days... Okay, Dad's ledger has to be in here somewhere. Hopefully it has the combination to the safe. I always accepted that Richard's rather unorthodox... This music is familiar. It's beautiful. <laughs> it appears Sir Reginald's helmet fell off. Or oh, didn't I put it back properly? I've created a clever little map for Lara's birthday expedition. I used the invisible ink Amelia picked up for me in Morocco so much. For God's sake, memorize the combination, you fool. Okay, got to find those objects to figure out the combination to the safe. There's something else here. lighter. I don't remember him ever using it, though. The Croft family crest and initials. P.C. I wonder if this belonged to my grandfather. Okay. Should be able to light the fireplace now. I've reached the monastery. As Roth predicted, it was hidden. Hmm, Dad was looking for an elixir. Was it the elixir of life? This is my handiwork. I used to love drawing pictures of tigers. Spent so many hours in here, reading, dreaming of my own adventures. One of Winston's notes. He always hid sweets for me to find. I remember this now. Each district in ancient Egypt had a symbol and a number. I always preferred these symbols to the actual number hieroglyphs. Now, let me see, let me see. These this was always one of my favorite books in this library. I used to trace hieroglyphs. So referencing the same source material. But where did I see this image? Dad, I think it's this one. In the chapter on Egyptian districts. Why, yes, I think you're right, Lara. I remember the page with the illustration of Ra. My goodness, you've been paying attention, haven't you? This could be an important breakthrough. This picture was taken in the library. Eighteen twenty edition. Does this mean I'm your research assistant? That and more, my darling girl. Takes me back. Those were good times. The best times. Took 
quite a tumble off of this old thing when I was a girl. Still feel it in the shoulder from time to time. of a key. I remember this map now. It leads to the master key. We made it with a special kind of invisible ink. It could only be seen with the heat of a fire. <sighs> hmm. I think I stashed one of Winston's master keys in here when I was a kid. the map. Looks like the key is hidden under a trunk near the bookcase. X marks the spot, as they say. key. This should get me into the West Wing. All right, this should open most rooms in the manor, including the Forbidden West Wing. crown from my birthday treasure hunt. How old was I again? Six? Eight? Hmm. I think this hieroglyph corresponds to a number, but which one? Okay, Dad's clues mention Mum's paintings and their anniversary. Hopefully I can find some answers in the West Wing. My lord, we all hope your work was well received. Mum's atelier had sealed it soon after she died. Untouched for years, exactly as she left it. I don't have any memory of this. I wish I could remember doing this. Mum died too young. Mum with me as a baby. I've never seen this. Hard to believe I was ever that small.
I stood up to my family's criticism, stood in defence of Richard and our love. But as my new life began in Croft Manor, doubt set in. You've almost got it, darling. Here, let me show you. Like this, see? <laughs> well done, Lara. Well done. I wonder how my life would have been different had she lived. This was for a show in London of Mum's work. What I wouldn't give to see this today. Hmm. It says here, Amelia Croft plans to show her work in New York. I wonder what... Lara arrived tonight, though not without a bit of drama, but... Mum's paintings. Which one was Dad's favourite? I returned home this afternoon to collect the last of my paintings. I suppose I should say, I returned to my family's home. Hmm, blocks of red. Dad's favourite painting. Maybe something about that painting will help me figure out the combination. I'm glad I still have so much of Mum's work. With Amelia gone, the manor is a different place. After everything Atlas I think this was Dad's pocket watch. Hmm, looks like it stopped precisely at midnight. Gun, how could you tell him about the expedition? It's just all been too much. I needed to talk to someone. He's still my brother. I don't trust him. You don't have to, Richard, but please, trust me. I'm sorry, my dear, but I know him. He'll take it to the papers. The investors will pull out. Then go. Without me. Tonight. I will take care of Atlas. And then meet you in Tibet next week. I was so young, but I still remember that terrible argument. It wasn't always an easy road for my parents. This is Dad. I suppose it's a family tradition, but I can't imagine having one of these made. My mother's perfume. The smell. So familiar. I can almost... I believe it took this trip to push me over the edge. I've been able to see Richard in his element, seeing him at his... Mum's wedding ring. I always wondered what happened to it.
The inscription is faded. I am bursting with pride. Amelia is with child. It is amazing how everything in life can change with such a simple event. Obviously, we don't know the gender, but already we've discussed possible names. Dad may have discovered the secret to immortality without even knowing it. Amelia would not have approved. That alone should have been the end of it. But I am, as God made me, a stubborn fool. I locked all the West Wings. At least that old thing still works. <laughs> Mum, on her wedding day, she looks so beautiful. There's a date, October something. Their anniversary was in October, but which day? I can't believe I don't know this. There's got to be another clue somewhere. I remember this. Dad gave it to Mum on her birthday. October 13th, Mum's birthday. Okay, back to the study to open that safe. Dad, what do you keep in there? Nothing too important, Lara. Estate business and such. If it's not important, then why bother putting it in a safe? I should know better than to try and pull one over on you. <laughs> there is something important in here. And it's for you, should you need it someday. Well, let's hope you came through for me, Dad. Mm, no, that's not it. Happy to know that Dad kept us safe. No, that's not what I'm looking for. I am numb. It is taking all my willpower to hold back the overwhelming grief. Amelia's plane crashed in the mountains. She died alone in the snow waiting. Dad, what did you do? Dad's sequel to his first book on immortality. He never got a chance to publish it. Handwritten. This is the only copy. Damn, this isn't it either. I was certain there had to be a will in here. Wait, what's that? Hmm, a blank page. must have left this for me. It has to be important. Hidden message.
Mistress Lara, I took the liberty of preparing... I just want... Oh no! I didn't even see that! Research safe. The renovations are proceeding in secret. The work crew Roth hired for the job have been paid half. It's over. I have done all that I could, and my Amelia is still cold and dead. Roth first... You brought her home. She's here, somewhere. Dad's Tibetan scroll. I remember he used to pour over this late into the night. It is silent, so peacefully silent now. Even after the mad... Mum faced death alone. She was so brave. Hmm, I wonder if Dad used this on his... This was part of a set of statues Dad found in China. He thought it was linked to the Temple of Shi. Richard, I tried to see you in person last week, but your manservant hus- Dad's collected knowledge. There must be so many secrets hidden in here. to hide his findings. There's an inscription. This is the Croft universe. Our knowledge is to the east, our respite to the west. Our future is to the south, our past is to the north. Our past to the north. Could there be something else beneath the manor? <laughs> huh. 
Hi, Dad. So I know I only just returned to school, but when can I come out to the dig site again? It's just so boring here. This bust of Anubis was from Dad's Egyptian collection. He must have put it down in the basement for our little expedition. You should also know by now, I'm not to be trifled with on this board, young lady. Mate. Lord Croft is resolved to seal the west wing of the manor. Oh, I am going to win, someday. future is to the south, our past is to the north.
Incredible. This crypt was here all along. I expected a sort of crushing finality to grip me when we returned to the... Dad, you did bring her home. My dearest Lara. It is difficult to write this, knowing these may only ever be words on a page to you. I wonder if you will remember my voice. Will you remember the way we used to play and laugh? Will you remember me comforting you when you were sad? Know that I'm still with you, Lara. My energy, my love, it's within you. It always will be. Use that energy to pursue your passions in life. Never let others determine your journey. You become who you are through your choices, through the love you give and the promises you keep. I hope you are happy, that you are loved and successful in whatever it is you choose to do. I am proud of you, my darling. Remember me, with all my love, your mother. Hmm, what's this? A letter. Lara, I have received the notarized affidavit confirming Amelia's grave and the discovery of the burial crypt within the manor premises. While I can't fathom why your father would hide your mother's fate from her own family, I cannot deny that any legal claims I may have had on the estate are now null and void. Croft Manor and the remainder of your father's assets are now yours in perpetuity to do with as you wish. If there comes a time when you require assistance in managing the estate, I hope you will consider contacting me to retain my services. Sincerely, your uncle. I've been so focused on defying my uncle, of fighting to keep his hands off this manor, that I never realized how much this place actually means to me. But since I've been here, I can feel the presence of my mother and father. I sense the entire history of my family and the deep roots we have in this place. I want to honor my parents. I want to honor all of my ancestors. The Croft family may be all but destroyed, but I will make our name and our home great again.